thing, or welcome back to SOS MBA. And I know a lot of you are probably wondering if, you know, if you could tell time, if you could figure out what date it is uh, during the apocalypse. Let's pretend an EMP has went off and everything shut down, or just the grid's down completely. Someone took out, someone um, uh, took out some hardware and we no longer have power or whatever. And for whatever reason, you know, the clock stops and you want to know how to do stuff differently. And this is a good option for that. Now these you can pick up online anywhere. I have a, there's a really good example right here. This one's a really good example and it's a better size. This one is, it's cool, but uh, I, I don't like it. It wears easy, and if you're gonna have some, this one is a, I believe a, I have to pull over here, Let's see if you can, I'll pull it over so that you can read what I read. See, that is a 50 year, is it 50 year? Yeah, 50 year, can you see that? Right there, 50 year, this is it right there. Okay, 50 year calendar, it's a sailor's calendar. <clears throat> sailor's calendar right so that you can you can still figure out what date it is now you just spin the dial you spin the dial to the month to the year all right you take your month and you'll get your exact calendar hang on i'm gonna pull it so you can see it because i'm pretty sure if i zoom up like this you might not see what i'm seeing there you go all right, you'll look to February over here, and you'll line that up with 2021. And then you'll come down here, and today's date, the date that I'm making the video, would be Monday the 8th. Okay, it gives you the exact time and date. These are our exact date that you're looking for, so you can get the calendar, okay? So this would be your calendar. You could just hang this up, um, you you would leave this for years. It's got 50 years of use. You could be at sea for 50 years, right? It'd be crazy, right? It's been a few years, three years aboard ship for me. Uh, but you could hang this up um, in near your rack where you sleep or something like that, and you'll always have a calendar. And you can just turn it and switch the calendar to next year or whatnot. There's that one. This one I like better. I think I like this one better because it's just way easier to see. Now, this one I've had for decades. I mean, I, I had this when I, I joined the military. I, I just kept it with me most of the time. And it always tripped out my friends and other sailors that had never seen one. And well, the way this one's set up, it's exactly the same. Now, this one's the 100 year. <laughs> I've had this for a long time. And this is the 100 year calendar. And... This will still work. Someone would still be able to use this long after I'm dead. Uh, <laughs> it's crazy because it's it's got so many years you can use this for. Now this one even gives you the the second the second Feb. Um, it also covers uh, your leap years. It, it covers that as well. And coming down here, you have the exact calendar as it would appear on uh, on a calendar that you would get from someone else. Same thing, and it's really neat. You just give it a spin, put it on the year, and that's it, just like that. Twist it till it gets to where it needs to be, and then stop it, and there you go, there's your calendar. So, <laughs> I had to bring this out just in case I needed to show you for that, and you could also use this for something else. We could get to that. I have a lot of antiques and weird things, uh, stuff like this. A lot of this stuff I've got overseas, uh, kind of like this one here. Different places that I'd been or wherever, I picked stuff up. While I, one of my favorites, you gotta have a, you gotta have a compass, right? This is just one of my favorites I've had for years. You lift this up, and you get your sight, sight alignment, and you've got. The compass will work when it when she lifted up, and if this is a really useful item to have, and you gotta have something that's 
strong and won't break. <laughs> I've seen some I've seen some of these are like plastic, they're like toys. Anyway, so something like this, it will last a lot longer than most. That's the reason why I have it. And plus I like collecting things that are brass for some reason. I don't know. Here's this gets me on to <laughs> oh shit. Should I show you this now? This gets me on to that. <laughs> Telling time with the power of the sun. Um, this is another useful tool for telling time. And now you would have one of these aboard ship. You could keep this um, above deck and you look out and get your, you could set this right on the deck. And some people just leave these outside. Uh, they'll make a nice little, you know, contraption to hold them and, you know, level them up and everything. And, and make them all nice and pretty and stand them up. But anyways, uh, apocalyptic times, you could do these things on the ground. Uh, and some, there's some great images out there of examples. One of the ones that I, I actually want to do a project the same way so my son can go out and stand and do some, uh, uh, be, able to, uh, be able to tell the time just by looking at the sun. This one here works the same way. It takes the image your sun, the, the sun and the shadow, and casts it, and you can get the exact time. This also has the compass as well. You can lift the needle uh, the same way. Bring this over, and the needle lifts. And it'll tell you exactly where to line it up at. You can bring this in here, and that'll guide, that, that will ride right into that rail there. And as the sun beams down on it, you'll get the exact time it is right now. And uh, as long as you, as long as you put it in the right position, so just face this. Let's give it a twist. Right. Let's see, right about here. And then try to get your time, and. The light will come in and it'll beam down and it'll give you the exact time that it is. And there you go. And another another one that I like, I'll take outside. One that I I really think is cool is one that I carry around with me. Now it's portable. I even have a uh, my kids. They all have little gadgets for telling time, right? Uh, uh, but this guy here now this would be all right let me bring it down so you can see better i know it's hard to see this fits your this will fit your ring finger or whatever uh, i usually just hang these around my uh neck knives at the top at the top collar i just hang it there and i carry it around with me just for you know fun this also has your sections for leap years and uh you can clock it in with your month you would put your February there. I'll take you outside and I'll show you how this works. My kids carry these around, like and not this one exactly, but they carry around the uh, uh, the one with the, uh, it's got a little gem inside of it and they hold it up in the sun and it'll tell the exact time uh, every every single time. They just hold it up and it just do, 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 and it does its thing and it shows them. It's pretty neat. Uh, I'm gonna go drag the kids out here for that one. Let's go outside and play with this one real quick. works if you you line the hole that's for the sun put it on your month it's February right <laughs> and it'll tell you it's the exact time and it's you just point it directly at the sun get it exactly at the sun like that and it says it's 10 o'clock right now which is it is 10 o'clock uh, but yeah, it'll tell you the exact time. 
just by you don't need a, no longer need a watch <laughs> just carry this thing around with you and then just put it on the month and point it at the sun and there you go it says it's 10 o'clock it's that easy pretty nifty little tool i'll put that in a link below in case you guys need it i hope this helps and there's many other unique ways that you can do a, uh, a sundial of your own in your backyard or whatever there's different types of sundials out there you can get your exact time and everything like that you can get the you can get the calendar it tells you everything and just by standing on the block and letting the sun do the rest it'll tell you the exact date the exact time and everything that you need to know and it's a pretty cool nifty little thing you can build one in your backyard out of concrete a little bit of bricks or something just write some numbers on it somehow and that's how you do it that's all there is anyways god bless you guys take care